Hey everybody, um, it's Miss Erin here. I hope that you are doing well. Um, I can't believe that it's almost the end of April already, um, which is crazy. Um, I know that you're doing, hope that you're doing well, um, and I hope that you're still finding time to read um, your Nehemiah Kids and your Leaders in Training lessons. Um, just reminding you that you're on week 15 um, this week, and Miss Morgan's going to give you an awesome memory verse activity um, for you to use this week. But my prayer is that you're still digging into the Word and that you're getting to know the Lord more and more throughout this time. Um, that we can find hope and depend upon Him and Him alone. Um, I hope that you're well. If you need anything, please let me know. Um, I hope that you'll have a great day, and uh, we'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Hey, IBC families. I'm glad you're tuning in again this week. And just like the previous weeks, I'm going to show you guys a list of the memory verses for each age group, and then I'll give you all two different activities you can do at home with your kids. You ready? Here are the memory verse assignments for this week. Feel free to pause and take a picture or write down your memory verses. Here are the things you'll need for the first activity. Painter's tape is preferable. Hey guys, so for the first activity, it's gonna be hopscotch with your memory verse. I'm about to show you an example that I found on Pinterest, but you can also do this with chalk outside. Hey guys, this is the last activity and just as usual, for this activity there's no supplies needed. Um, you can do it to music, snapping, clapping, or whatever. Here's an example. Lazy hands make a man poor, but diligent hands bring wealth. Proverbs 10, 4. Thanks y'all for watching and I really miss you guys and hope y'all are all doing well and I hope y'all have fun doing these activities. See y'all next week. Bye!